Hey guys, what's up and welcome back to Minecraft. It's Styx here and today we've got a lot of stuff to do. Let's eat an apple because that's super cool. That, that's what cool people do. All right, as you can see, this farm is all full here. I am going to make... Uh, why is this not growing? What, what is up with this one? What a crazy thing. Anyways, guys, uh, today, let's see how much wood we've got, actually. So we got uh, almost the whole stack there and almost the whole stack there. Fantastic. We're getting sticks, leaves, all sorts of things. That's good. Those are so awesome. You don't have to do anything and you just get free wood. Um, yes, guys, what are we going to do today? First of all, we need to get more power and we need to get all this stuff into drawers. So we need to have a look in here. And we need to make a draw controller. We need to make a draw controller. So what do we need for that? Stone, comparators, and um, yeah, basic draw in the middle there, and a diamond. Okay, how many diamonds do we have? One currently. That should be enough. Okay, this is filling up really quickly. We've got to be careful. Uh, these little guys are going nuts down here. Are any of these filling up with too many items? So this one's got 20 gravel. This one's got four dirt. No, we seem to be all right on some of the, most of these things. Um, okay, guys. So, yeah, that's what we need to do. We need to make the draw controller. Um, I didn't show you guys this last episode, but this is what we got going on here. We have a mycelium with a bucket of... with Sorry, with a stone barrel full of water, which it gets from down here at this um, aqueous accumulator. So you just put water on either side of this. It picks it up, and that transports it into here. And then when you've got a barrel on mycelium and it's surrounded, it goes even faster. But you only need one piece, but it gets much faster the more piece you have. It transforms into witch water. And when it does, we stick some sand in it from this basic drawer up here, which has got 64 in here and then another 39 in here. And then that comes out into this basic drawer over here and gives us soul sand. Um, and the soul sand we can sift to get gas tears. And I believe um, nether quartz, which we use to make uh, the, the flux. Uh, it's it's some glass that we need for the upgrades for these things. So I'm going to try upgrade these two on the corner to these reinforced ones. So, oh wait, it's only one that's not reinforced. Uh, really need the singulum stuff as well. How do we, how do we make that? Um, sing, actually let's just find thermal expansion. Hang on, we need to type at at the beginning. Thermal expansion, it's on the second page here, I believe. Okay, here we go. Uh, so we need we need some of this. Oh. Cryothium. I I don't think we can get this stuff. Pulverizer, blizz rod, snowball, and some blizz powder. Oh, I see. So if we have, if we have a fluid transposer, we can put XP onto snowballs and that will give us blizz powder. I mean that's quite good. I, I would like to do that. That, that would be fantastic. So how do we make a fluid transposer? That is the real question, guys. Because that would be very handy, actually. Fluid transposer. Where are you, my friend? There we go. Uh, so we need copper gear, one of them, one of them. Oh, we can make this. Okay, and then we need snowballs. Um, how do we get snowballs? I think we get snowballs out of here as well. Uh, snowballs. Uh, how do we make these? Snow block, mob drops... Uh, we can get a chicken to do it, we can get a pulverizer, uh, maybe we can't get snowballs. Glacial precipitator, uh, so we need to make that as well. That's a, that's, a, that's a lot of work guys, I might just make a few more of these and upgrade them to the uh, reinforced ones. Uh, because, let's check the power out, do we still, ha we still have power. Um, no, overall we're still losing power, we're about to run out, so... We're going to need more power for a lot more items, so we need to get working on that. We need to get more power production, because that's just not good enough. Um, if we check out the book, do we have any rewards? No. If we do some of these challenges... Um, I need to get some witch water, actually. That, that'll be a challenge, so this is at 30%. If we take this off for now, we'll be able to take a bucket out of there. Oh, we better take this off as well, so it doesn't put the sand in. And we'll fill that back up. Okay, when that transforms, which doesn't take too long, we'll fill up a bucket with that, which we don't have any on us. Anyways, guys, let me do some work to uh, get this power situation sorted out, and I'll get the draw controller created with a bunch of drawers and things. And also, we need the compacting drawers. So, compacting draw, one of these things. Uh, so, that's relatively cheap. Okay, let me make a bunch of this stuff, and uh, let's get it all sorted out here. 
Okay guys, we've got half of this wall up, well actually most of it up, we've got most of the stuff out of here but it's filling all back up. Eventually this is going to go into this draw controller in the middle here, and it's going to sort into all of this stuff. So these here are the compacting drawers. So as you can see, you can put, you can pull it out whichever way you want. So this dust stuff, if we pull it out, makes 64, and you can convert it into the nickel ore. But here, it says 13, so you can put these back in, and it'll be, it'll say 29 now, but that will go up as well. So you can pull either ore out, either ore, huh, <laughs> that's funny, I didn't do that by purpose. But anyway, so you can pull out all 29 of these, and then those are gone as well. But you put those back in, and that can... That can be that. So uh, I hope that was some sort of explaining. Anyways, guys, I'm just um, waiting on enough wood, oak wood now to put in the rest of these basic drawers. So yeah, we've got all this stuff sorting. I'm just sorting this stuff out. Eventually, we're going to take this uh, cable from this chest and put it into this drawer controller here, which will sort it all automatically into these drawers. So this drawer controller is connected to all of these which is fantastic. So all we're going to do is put a cable into the into the bottom of here. Uh, we'll route that around here, I suppose. We can bring that right around through here. Um, I need to, I just got an ender pearl, so we need to get some iron and put that in here. Uh, let's just check that though, guys. I really do not want to mess this up. So conduit, um, we've got this. Uh, we need the pulsating iron, which is, yes, that and that. Okay, very good. Um, I just want to check. I think if we press P, this will this will show us if we've got some in a chest somewhere. Hang on a second. If we press, is it P? I think it it makes a chest like flash or something. I I don't know. Um, I'm just trying things out, but I don't think there is. I bet it's in one of these if it's anywhere. I can't find it right this minute, but I don't really want to make any more if I have enough. But I think. We may have used it all. There's no cables in here, is there? Okay, so that's all of our storage, basically. So, yeah, we need to use that one ender pearl then. So, piece of iron and an ender pearl. There we go, into our very super duper slow uh, smelter, alloy smelter. Okay, I'm going to get the rest of these done, guys. This is all of these, I think. If not, if there's more of these, which I don't think there is. I think we got all of these out. Um, if there's more of these, we shall put in a few more. But... Let's get some more wood. Uh, we're just waiting on the wood machine over here. And while we're doing that, I think I'm going to make the farmer block, guys. So if we just type in farmer in here, I believe it's this one. What do we need? Iron. Oh, a nori crystal block. Oh, okay. Iron casting. I think we can do, I think we've got black quartz somewhere. Is it shift P after press? Oh, I don't know. If we just click, um, we will... Um, oh, black quartz ore. Okay, we do have that stuff somewhere. Um, a nori crystal blocks. How do we make these? Factorizer? Atomic? Um, what, what is this? Atomic reconstructor. Can we make that? That sounds complicated. Atomic reconstructor. Um, oh, I believe we can make this. This is not expensive. Okay. Let's let's make this and then we can make the farming block afterwards and then that will farm all of this for us automatically And we won't have to do it and it's it's really really good block. It's it's amazing actually uh, Five more wood. We're, we're waiting on this like this is this gives us 23 But then we got to put the chests in the middle here and how many is this gonna give us three like it's it's not enough guys It's just not enough. Okay. Well, let's carry on place it in these and we just take um, our uh, one of these and one of these and one of these and we're gonna have one more there for this crystal so these it's kind of an order guys we got like emeralds and diamonds together we got the redstone and the stuff over here i don't really know it's but it's in as much order as i can put it in anyways so we could just be able to come along here and pick out what we need from all of our sifter dudes which have by the way got enough power now we've actually got a million rf stored up in here we've almost got that and this one will start filling up afterwards i believe because we got an extra one in here which is reinforced so these are all reinforced now except for this guy he's uh, super duper and yeah okay let's carry on i'm gonna get this wall finished guys and we'll get this uh atomic reconstructor doing doing that's not a word but we do have that stuff so let's uh get this out i guess how do we how do we get this out of here do we smelt it let's let's see do we smelt this i believe we smelt this do we get that stuff let's take that out 
No, uh, okay, that's... Oh, there we go. It did work. It's just lagging a bit. Okay, fantastic. Put that all back in. You, you carry on making stone. Okay, guys, we have the reconstructor here. So I think what we can do is it'll be on redstone mode. Uh, no, we do not want to make another one of those. We did make uh, another one of these. So we'll be able to make the farming block as soon as we put some iron on there. Hang on, if you just take farming. Is it a full iron block? No, not farming, just farmer is what we want. That thing there. Uh, we need these, which is a full iron block. Okay, so we need to make four iron blocks. Do we have enough in here? I bet we don't. Uh, I told you we don't. Guys, we just don't. Let's get some more iron out of here. That should be enough. Make one more block here. Fantastic. Um, and also, I think what we can do is get some stone out of here and make a pressure plate. And, oh, actually, I think we need a wooden one, don't we? A wooden one. There we go. Because items don't go on stone pressure plates, I don't believe. I don't know. I always forget. So what we do now is we just chuck this on there. And it fires. Fantastic. Now these should be these Anori crystals. Okay, cool. So we have the farmer now, guys. Uh, we need some seeds. Where would we find seeds? Seeds are in here. Uh, we have one seed. That's, that's, that's not good enough, guys. We need some more seeds. Okay, well, I didn't think about that, did I? Okay, guys, we got our pulsating iron, so we will turn that into item conduits in a second. Actually, let's just do it right now. We should have the binder around here. Actually, we put it in here, didn't we? Let's just grab 16. That will do us just dandy. Put these in here. Actually, is that enough? No, that, but I mean, that's enough cable for us. We need two more binder. Guys, let's just do it. Might as well do it because, um, yeah. Oh my goodness, birds outside. The problem with this is I can't really record re-record these things because once I've done them, then I've done them. I can't I, I can't re-record these things. Stupid birds outside. I heard seagulls in the back of my other video. Oh damn things. Anyway, let's let's pipe this all into here and let's get rid of this and this. And this should all start sorting the stuff into here. And anything that's extra should go into these. So we need to pipe this out of here. So actually what we can do is go down here quickly and put that cable back. And we can put it on extract only and always on and there we go we can push that into the whole system so this should start draining out now let's organize this we should be able to see it organ is it is it going out i don't i don't know oh wait a second we even put this on insert so of course it's not going anywhere we need to get below so we can click on this we need to put this on insert and Yes, fantastic. There we go. We can turn extract off. We don't want that on for now. Okay, so that chest should be emptying now, and all of these should be going in there as well. All the stuff from here has been going in, and this stuff is emptying out quite quickly. Okay, so this chest should be empty soon, and this should all start to fill up, which is fantastic. We now have this all organized, guys. All our outputs from here are all organized. Now, I did another thing. So we have this energy transfer node, which is a wireless transfer thing. So what you do is you get these GPS markers and you click on where you want the energy to go. So we want it to go here. So we've saved this as this GPS. Mar oh, I've done both of them, haven't I? We need to do just one. We can, we'll just do this one that's in my inventory. That's in my hotbar, sorry. And all we do is we run over here, put it in here. And then if we run over here, we can see it's working fantastic it's uh gathering up all our resources and replanting everything now and it's done the whole farm wait how come it's only done one side oh there it goes okay cool very good okay well now we don't need to do anything but i will replace some of these carrots and things uh soon with some wheat so do we have any more seeds uh i got wheat can i get seeds from that um Hang on, I had some seeds. Are they in here? Oh, I don't know. Maybe... Wait, hang on a second. Is this wheat? Okay, that's wheat there, so we should get more seeds. I'm just going to put this in here for now. Okay, fantastic. That should be doing all of that. I wonder if it does the sugar cane. I'm not too sure. We needed paper to make these GPS markers. Okay, so we've got enough power now. I'm not sure how much power that thing over there is going to use, but... It looks like we're keeping up just now. We've got this sorted. Once this is empty, we'll get rid of this chest. And it's all coming together, guys. We need to start making this look a little prettier, though. So obviously this needs to come out here, doesn't it? We need to make this room a little bit bigger. But guys, it's it's all starting to come together now. We should uh, check in our logbook here, our quest book, because I think 
We did get another quest or so. Oh, we've got some potatoes and carrots in our inventory. Let's get rid of those first. We don't want any of that in here. Okay, cool. Clear inventory. Let's check the quest book, guys. Oh, we did make the witch water. Okay, very good. Let's get a reward. Flux spore. What is that? What what does that do? Um, we've got some more of these storage ones. We got one here. We got some upgrade magical. I don't know what these are for. Um, resonant jet pack. I doubt I can charge that, but I won't have enough power to charge that thing. But we got a jetpack. 25,000 RF. I mean, that is amazing. But we're just going to put that in here for now. That's um, I'm not going to use my power on that. But what does this do? This is... Oh! Okay. Well, that's amazing. Can we change the mode or anything? Shift for details. Press V to adjust drilling area. Oh, okay. So what have we got right now? That's one. Whoa, 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 whoa. Tutorial. I, I didn't want to do that. So we're on single block. V. Double block. That's three times three. Three times three times three. And a five times five. Okay. Well, let's just put it on three times three now so it acts like our thing. Okay. This thing's going to be great. We're going to leave that there. I love this thing. This, this is awesome. You just start chopping things. Oh, my eyes. I look terrible. Okay, guys. We do not have a ceiling, but we do have a nice wall here. So that's good. We will build the ceiling eventually. Right now, we've just got this mess. But I went for some uh, random ones in the corner here. And then we've got the same outline that we have on the floor here. So yeah, I think that looks pretty cool. I've done it around here, and we will probably have another wall on this side, which where all the mob drops will go, that we will probably work on a mob farm down there some somewhere next episode, and all the mob drops will come into this side. We'll have another drawer controller and a whole bunch of basic drawers. So that will be that, guys. Um, I made a bunch of this energetic silver ingots so we could make some more energy cables that carry more electricity, but I don't think that's the problem here. We're still draining power. Um, I think that's because this thing here is using it. Uh, no, it's 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 done now, so we should be gaining power again. Uh, where is all the power going? I haven't added anything in a while, except for this farmer over here, which is not using anything right now. Um, oh, and by the way, look, it does uh, do the sugar cane, so that's fantastic. That's really good as well. Right, we've got some rare loot case common, so let's do the common first. We got some ink and a, we got some chicken eggs. Uncommon loot case. Oh, floral fertilizer. That's good. Uh, let's get rid of that glowstone quickly. If we just uh, double click on here, everything that goes into any of these will come out of our inventory and go in there. And we've got a rare loot case here. And we've got an ender tether. What? What is an ender tether? Guys, what is this thing? Ender tether. Uh, is, is that it? What? What is this thing? Can we use it to make anything? Prevents Endermen within a certain distance from teleporting away. Any teleportation attempts will warp them to the tether. Also prevents other forms of Ender teleportation. Oh, I see. Interesting, guys. Okay. Well, that's good, guys. We got this all sorted out now. Alright, guys. Last thing today is we may be able to get um, some of these achievements here. Kill a Wither Skeleton. We may be able to do that. If we chuck Witch Water in here, it should flow. And transform these guys into uh, maybe some wither skeletons or something. Uh, wither skeleton, there we go. Oh, and a charged creeper. Okay, we got got to make sure we don't blow that guy up because that could be that could be very very bad. If we kill a wither skeleton, there we go. Quest completed. So the witch water turns them into wither skeletons. Uh, any skeletons into with the skeletons. So we'll kill a couple of these guys here um, And hopefully we get a drop of evil. We got some wither dust. That's not what we want We want a drop of evil that is for our mob farm that we're gonna make in the future But for now, I think we'll just hey 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 you're a skeleton Do you turn into wither or is it just a chance? Oh, no, you're with a skeleton and you're dead. Okay, fantastic and you whoa I feel like you almost could hit me through there. These guys are crazy. I don't think we got one. Let's just check, pick that up. Oh, we did get a drop of evil. Okay, fantastic, guys. We will use that on the next episode. That will make us a nice big mob farm over there. Now, what I've been doing so far is building these tunnels like this and then just having them end. But I think we're going to have to build a tunnel off in this direction and maybe go off to the sides to make our mob farm because currently 
We're going to run out of space. If we go there, 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 and there, then that's it. That's, that's going to be all there is. So guys, next episode, we're going to make a mob farm. Also, I think we'll be getting rid of the smeltery. We don't actually need it. It's fun. It looks cool. But there is a better way. We can uh, pulverize this dust stuff um, when it comes in this form here. When we get it like this, we can um, pulverize that and that will make two. So, and then we can smelt that up in like an electrical smelter. So we're going to need some more power generation next episode. And we're going to, so what I'm going to do basically is I think off camera before the next episode is move this all around. So this is all sorted out and making power better. And maybe behind the scenes, we'll move it back a bit. And also, yeah, we'll, we'll, um, the next episode, we'll get the, the pulverizer going and we'll also get a machine to smelt it up instead of having this huge multi-block structure, which is actually really, really slow. And then we'll get it all automatically stored in maybe some drawers. You know what? We could, if we move this whole system backwards down there, we could have the drawers here and have all this behind the scenes. So that's probably a good idea, actually. This could be the room of drawers. Okay, that's a good idea. Let's let's do that in next episode. And we'll get a mob farm going, which will uh, fill up all the drawers on this side that we're going to make. Okay, also, quickly, guys, we've got all the bonsai pots going now. We've got a birch one, a jungle one, oak, spruce, and the dark oak going. So we should be getting dark oak now, which we are. It's good. We're still getting oak wood. Should be getting jungle wood now. And we're getting the birch wood and cocoa beans. Awesome. Okay, and our farmer thingamajig is just going fantastically. Okay, guys, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this, please hit that like button, and I'll see you guys in the next episode.